So one question I get a lot is, is a 22 good for everyday carry? So we're going to go over the pros, the cons, the good, the bad, the ugly, truth, everything about a 22 for concealed carry. So first of all, if you are going to carry a 22, get a good one. This is a very good 22. This is a Walther P22. In my opinion, this is probably one of the best 22s you can buy. It has a match grade barrel. And the barrel is actually fixed in place, so the barrel doesn't move. It's there, which makes it very accurate. It's a very good, very good gun. A little bit on the pricey side, but it's worth it. Uh, this one, so if you do get a Walther mag, it's ambidextrous, same with the safety, and the trigger too. <laughs> so one of the cons to this particular one, you can get like Caltex that hold a lot of ammo. This one only holds ten rounds, but the phrase better than nothing absolutely fits this because it is absolutely better than nothing. I am six foot two, 250 pounds. And dude, you shoot me in the chest with this <laughs> anywhere, really. I'm going to change my attitude in a hurry. So let's get loaded up. One great thing about a 22 for concealed carry is the ammo. You can sit there and shoot. 500 thousand rounds out of this thing for cheap and you can get very good with your weapon because you're shooting 45 9 mil 9 mil ain't too bad but you get my point you're shooting 45 or 10 millimeter or something 44 mag magnums you're gonna rack up a huge bill 20 bucks gets you like 500 rounds and you can literally sit here all day and just 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 practice so that's what we're gonna do okay real quickly on ammo you want to get high velocity ammo for any semi-auto <laughs> If something happens, it's because this ammo, actually, there was something wrong with this ammo from the factory. Because some of them are just, I don't know, we'll see. Get yourself good ammo. So these are, obviously, you can tell I bought these a long time ago for 380 398 because now it would be a lot more. These are hollow points. They're Gold Dot, Velocitor, CCI. These work amazing. So practice with these. Use these to carry. I have a golf ball up there. Let me see if I can get it. I think this gun shoots to the right. Ah, oh, so close. Let's go turkey. There we go. Nah, that was super close, that golf ball. So I got the regular Remington, and then I got one of them Velocitor hollow points in the bottom. And we're going to show you how powerful it is. I'll shoot the 2x4. Okay, regular one. Right, let me set that back up. Okay, so that one went through two of them. This is a Velocitor hollow point. Let's see what it does. There it goes. Wow, you can tell that one shot so much better. Of course, it's raining again. So, that was the first one, second one. So, you... So the hollow point exploded in the second one. The regular round nose went through two two by fours and stuck in the third. Come on back. Nope. So I mean you penetrate two 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 by fours. And that one's in there somewhere. So yeah. They do penetrate. They do work. So let's see. Uh let's see if we can maybe hit the like a squash or something with a hollow point. Okay, we got a Velocitor in here, focus or not, but anyway, we got a squoosh there, since it is fall season, going into winter, we're supposed to get snow tomorrow. Anyway, let's see what this does. Yeah, it just went straight through it. <laughs> let's check it out real quick here. All right, so you blew a decent sized hole in there. Yeah, I, I kind of thought it would explode more, but yeah, all right, there it is, real proof. But like I said, I mean that thing about ripping through there. If you'd shoot somebody with that, or an animal, I'm, I'm telling you, I seen 22s in person do some serious damage. So, all right. So one other one other thing that's good about 22 is you can get a bunch of shots on target real quick. Here, I want to kind of putter out. 
Okay, well there it is. So 22 for everyday carry or concealed carry. So it gets get some good ammo. And it, when I whenever I get around the neighborhood, I take my dog for a walk or something. I like this. I just put it in my pocket, and we're good to go. And you can see it's it's effective. You get some good hollow points. You put a handful of them and them things in someone's ass. I'm telling you, it'll stop them. So would I recommend carrying it? I mean, sure. You know, it's better, like I said, better than nothing. I would, I, I would carry something else, but if that's all I had or had access to, like I said, there's a lot of pros. You get good practice with some crap ammo, get yourself some good ammo for carry, and then, like I said, it's better than nothing. So hope you liked the video, just a quick little one. And if you have any comments or ideas or anything, feel free to let me know. Take care.